Space watchers expect to be busy all weekend trying to detect where a wayward Chinese rocket will fall to the Earth in the next few days. Now, China's foreign ministry predicts it will cause no harm. Other agencies, they are not so sure. Ramey Innocencio reports on the orbital mission that went way off course. China's space station ambitions blasted off last week. A massive rocket called the Long March 5B powering the station's core module into orbit where future astronauts will live. The 20-ton rocket was not supposed to fly that high, but it did, and now it's out of control. Bill Harwood is CBS News space analyst. So what went wrong? The Chinese don't build their rockets so that you can restart the engines and deliberately drive them out of orbit whenever you want to. It's coming down on its own. It apparently is tumbling. Hurtling around Earth at 17,000 miles an hour. That's about 83 football fields each second. And it's orbiting us north to south at a tilt of about 41 degrees. Below its path is mostly water, but still a lot of land. Much of the U.S. from Chicago southwards, South America, Australia, Asia, Europe, and Africa. That means it could pretty much land, crash really, uh, almost anywhere on the planet, right? That's right. And the odds are it won't hit anybody or any populated uh, in area, but it could. The Pentagon does have the strike capability to shoot the rocket down, but they've said they won't. If you hit a spacecraft with a weapon and break it up, Instead of one big piece, you've got thousands and thousands of pieces. That threatens the thousands of other satellites in orbit and could string a wider swath of debris across the Earth. For CBS This Morning, Ramey Innocencio, Hong Kong. Mm, feel, feel comforted now? Yeah, right. I keep remembering what I learned in fifth grade. 70% of the earth is water. Water, that's so right. hopefully lands yeah, in the water. That means 30% ain't. I know. <laughs> I love the line, you know.